Hello and welcome to this tutorial on Introduction to IAT in Java. In this tutorial, we will explore the basics of Internet of Things and how to implement IAT technology in Java. Let's start with understanding what Internet of Things IAT is. IAT refers to a network of physical devices that are connected to the Internet and are instrumental in collecting and exchanging data. These devices can range from simple sensors to complex systems, like smart homes or industrial machinery. Using Java to create IAT systems allows developers to leverage Java's security platform independence and scalability features. Java's support for multithreading and distributed computing makes it a great choice for building IAT systems. Now let's dive into some code to understand how we can create IAT systems using Java. First, we need to set up a connection to the IAT device we want to communicate with, 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 with. We can use the Java QTT message queuing telemetry transport client library to establish the connection. MQTT is a widely used protocol for IAT devices to communicate with each other. Once the connection is established, we can use various commands to get data from the device, publish data to the device, and subscribe to messages from the device. For example, to publish data we can use the publish command as follows. Similarly, we can subscribe to messages from the device using the subscribe command as follows. In this way, we can use Java to create IAT systems that can communicate with various IAT devices, collect data, and perform various automation tasks. I hope this tutorial helped you understand the basics of IAT in Java. Stay tuned for more tutorials on advanced IAT concepts using Java. Thanks for watching and happy coding.